This is a really exciting time for Lurstoff. There's lots of investment going on and this is part of the regeneration of the town. Um, and the Gullwing Bridge is part of that to improve connectivity, not just across the town for obviously for cars and vehicles, but also for pedestrians and cyclists, but also actually for the wider area. Uh, people have been talking about having another bridge in Lurstoff for many, many years and it's really good news and you can see now it's actually coming out of the ground and making really significant progress. NAV1 stands for the North Approach Viaduct. Span 1 is going to be the first span of the North Approach Viaduct which will approach the Bascule Bridge which will be in the centre of Luke Loading. The span itself will be 52 metres. This particular section of steel is actually 59 metres because it projects a little beyond Pier 7 which it will be resting on. Well, it's the first significant milestone um, of the project with regards to what we can actually see. This is the first bridge span, which is of the Gullwing Bridge, which has obviously been a long time coming for the local people. Um, so it's a significant milestone to actually physically see the first section arrive here on site in Lowestoft. It is a complex operation to ensure that we don't damage the steelwork in its temporary state between fabricating it, moving it, from Belgium all the way to here. It was a tight fit coming through the existing Vasco Bridge, but that was planned, and um, as are all the other sections that are soon to come, they will all be very tight. The next stage is that we need to get it off the barge, so we'll soon drive it off the barge using SPMTs, which are uh, modular transport units. It will get loaded onto SPMTs and driven off using ramps onto the quay. We're then going to divert the road of commercial road and drive it across the road onto a temporary support slab which we've constructed specially for it to sit on. What the Gullwing Bridge does is provide us the means of delivering real tangible benefits to the low staffed economy which can bring significant improvements and benefits to local people. This is one of many investments and, and it's all about really focusing on the regeneration of the town. And so this is really part of that investment to encourage business and to support businesses bringing further investment into the town. I'd just like to thank all the residents and businesses of Lerstoff for being so patient during the construction. Clearly there has been disruption in and around the site and we realise that it, that is causing uh, some frustration to local residents and to businesses. We will do all we can to get through this quickly. Uh, that clearly there are long-term benefits of the bridge to the town uh, and thank you again for your patience and understanding during the construction.